Hello everyone. So for today's course, we'll be working on multiplication and our module is multiplication and addition. So we're going to work on multiplying the same question in two ways and adding those questions in another two ways. But you'll see what I mean on the next slide. Make sure to copy it down. It will be helpful later. If you would just like to rewind it later while you're doing your activities, that's also fine. But we're going to go ahead and just jump into it. So here we have multiplication and addition, and we're going to be working on the problem 3 times 4 equals 12. So four ways of writing this question is A, the same way it's already written. So 3 times 4 equals 12 is one way of writing it. Then we have the twin of it, which is the same question, just flipped, and we learned that in another lesson, which is 4 times 3 equals 12. So that's two ways to write this question. And then we have here... 4 plus 4 plus 4 equals 12. That's the third way to write this question. And our last and final way of writing this question is 3 plus 3 plus 3 plus 3, which equals 12. So that was four ways of writing the same question. So go ahead and copy these if you're writing notes because you will need these at the end for our module activity. If not, just you can always come back and see it. So we're going to do one more together, and then you're going to have one on your own. So our question is 6 times 4 equals 24. So the first way to write it is obviously the original way, which is 6 times 4 equals 24. The second way of writing it is flipping those numbers and giving the twin, which is 4 times 6 equals 24. And then we can add those 6s up, and we have 6 plus 6 plus 6 plus 6, which equals 24. Or we can add up all the 4s. We have 4 plus 4 plus 4 plus 4 plus 4 plus 4, giving us the grand total of 24. So this is four ways of doing the same question. Go ahead and copy these down or screenshot it so you can use it when you're completing your module.